So there are a few items that you need while you are living in Cambodia if you want to go to the fresh market and you want to be uh, completely plastic free. Uh, so yeah, the, the, I can show you what I use. Um, yeah, to yeah, just to put my my fresh food in some containers. Anyway, let's have a look. So this is what you actually need for for a trip to the market. So you can see two uh, glass containers, like two jars. And I'm going to use this for uh, these two, both for the palm sugar. And then we have some containers that I'm likely going to use for the tofu. And then I got a thermal bottle with me. The thermal bottle is for the coconut milk. And then, yeah, this is a, like made of plastic, but it's like a very common and cheap basket that you can buy anywhere in Cambodia. And this is going to be used for the vegetables. And then of course to be coherent with your ideology, uh, you are supposed to use a bicycle to get to the market. So as you can see, there is still quite a bit of plastic, but I'm managing to recycle everything. I mean, to wash the plastic bags that I'm given and then use them again whenever I can. However, there are some items such as, for example, these candles that are sold in a plastic bag. So there's nothing I can do about that. Uh, they're not sold individually, so I can't really open the, the packet. And then uh, there is this uh, Vietnamese incense, which I love very much because it's the most natural incense you can find at the market. Uh, I try to buy different brands, but they all uh, like smell really, really chemical. And so I don't really like them. And this is like really good. And I use it yeah, not to worship Buddha, though so sometimes, yeah, you, yeah, people think I do. <laughs> But I primarily use this for, for the mosquitoes in the bathroom and this is an excellent brand and it's uh, made in Vietnam. Then I, okay, I bought some fresh tofu and the fresh tofu here is fantastic. And then I tell you how to, uh, yeah, well, the best way to preserve it but anyway. As you can see, it's wonderful, it's quite soft and wet and it's usually sold in plastic bags but I told them that I don't want any plastic bags so they were kind enough to put the tofu inside my containers. I, I, I buy quite a lot all the time because I, I use it a lot. As a vegan I need a protein so I, well, I don't really need protein but anyway calcium and protein you get you can get calcium and protein from tofu and it's very good to preserve it just uh, um, fill the container with water and then put it in the fridge and it will last a long time I mean by a long time I mean about a week or so a, a week is the maximum okay then it gets quite sloppy and then I bought coconut milk and fresh coconut milk here, okay, this is my own plastic bag that I use to just put stuff inside. Okay, 
I just recycle this bag, keep recycling this bag because I, I need a, these are the, <clears throat> the glass jars I, I showed you at the beginning of the video and inside there is gorgeous palm sugar, fresh palm sugar, let's see if I can This is liquid palm sugar and it's, uh, well, okay, nothing to do with the palm oil industry uh, because this is like uh, locally grown and uh, locally collected by the Khmer, the Khmer people. And so you can be assured that the quality is very high and there are no chemicals inside, it's pure. And you can use it in uh, many different dishes or also in your dessert. It's like the taste is oh, wonderful. It's really, really good. I mean, you have to taste it. It's impossible to describe. It's like a toffee, mm, but it's really, it feels good. It's packed with minerals and other nutrients that are very, very good for the organism. Okay, and this was my mistake because at the last moment I decided to buy some fresh curry. This is a uh, Kumai curry and it's vegetarian okay so you can uh, in thailand you find a lot of curry but it's got like shrimps in it but this is in uh, in cambodia you can if you're vegan like me or vegetarian anyway you can be sure that this is 100 percent vegan and it tastes very very good and it's not as spicy uh, then i bought some yeah sweet potatoes because i'm cooking some curry today make some curry and uh, yeah here another problem now i bought some uh, bamboo, I think. Yeah, this is like, yeah, bamboo, and uh, I love it. You can put it in the curry, or you can do other things with it. And this is another problem. Also, they sell like peanuts, these are, like crushed peanuts, but they sell them in plastic bags, so it's very difficult to get them to put the um, the peanuts inside a container. But when I I'll, I'll be more fluent in Khmer, I'll, I will try to, yeah, to ask them. And then I bought some fresh veggies, and then uh, this is also another another thing that I did. You normally, uh, okay, I bought this from the same woman where I bought the palm sugar, and she has the best chili sauce on earth. I mean, this is to die for. Uh, this chili sauce is very very strong, and it's got just chili and garlic in it, and it's maybe some no, I don't think lemon juice, but anyway. It's very, very powerful as soon. So you just need a little bit and uh, you will uh, start crying. <laughs> and, I mean, you, 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 you will start tearing and, uh, you know, your nose will start running because it's so powerful, but very, very good for cleansing. And a little bit is good. I use it for my tomato sauce and uh, on top of pizza, uh, spaghetti. Yeah, well, whatever, whatever you want. And then I bought some some veggies, I don't know the name, some fresh veggies, uh, greens, some people they just put them in the blender and drink them but I prefer to eat my veggies and uh, wow this is a lot, okay, this was a warm, some, some people at the market they come straight from the countryside, they don't speak any English, my Khmer is not good enough and so and then th their prices are so cheap so <clears throat> I don't really want to uh, yeah, sometimes I don't want to, I want to help them, so I don't know how to help them. And my, the only way to help them is just buy what they're selling, you know, that's a, a, the easiest way. And uh, then I bought these vegetables that I love very much, but I don't know the name in English. They look like maybe huge lady's fingers. Maybe they are, I don't know. And yes, quite a few. And then my, one of my favorite veggies, uh, this is very good for the liver. This is, if you are cleansing, this is fantastic. And yeah, uh, they call it bitter gourd. And I can't remember the name in Thai. in Thai. I had a lot in Thailand as well. And then I bought some eggplants, okay. And yeah, the woman that was selling them as it was really straight from the market. Sometimes they just put like a, a blanket on the ground and put the veggies there, so you can choose whatever you want. 
and yeah they're very very good friendly people and you can be assured that they don't use any chemicals because chemicals are very expensive so it is much easier to grow the veggies like the traditional way